Welcome back to another topic review video on the Mr. Sin channel. Today we are going to be going into Unit 1, Topic 6, Ethical Guidelines in Psychology. Whenever researchers are conducting an experiment or study, it is important that both the researchers and the participants are protected. In 1892, the American Psychological Association, the APA, was established as the governing body that studied behavior. Eventually, in 1947, the APA created the first ethical committee to create standards that all psychological research must follow. And in 1974, the Institutional Review Board was created. The IRB was created to protect human participants. All colleges and universities use an IRB to conduct any experiments or research studies in psychology. Institutional Review Boards look at proposed research studies that have human participants. If the IRB does not believe that people participating in the study are being protected, well, they'll reject the study. When looking at approving a study or rejecting a study, the IRB will look to see if participants have the necessary information to make an informed decision. They'll also check to see if participants understand the risks of the study and will make sure sure that participants are free to choose whether or not they want to participate. All of this is known as informed consent. Researchers must give adequate information to their participants so they understand the risks of the study and can make rational decisions. The IRB will also look to make sure that the research is not unnecessary and risky and check to make sure that the participants have adequate protection. This includes making sure that participants have privacy and confidentiality. The IRB will also make sure that the benefits of the study outweigh the risks and that the study protects participants from any physical and also psychological psychological harm. Another protection committee that I want to briefly touch on is the IACUC, which stands for the Institutional Animal Care and Use Committee. This committee regulates and oversees animal care in research, teaching, and testing with animals. It is important that researchers set their studies up in an ethical manner. Ethical studies make sure they create a positive environment for the subjects where the participants can trust the researcher. This way participants can be assured that they will not be harmed and that the study will have a net benefit for society. Researchers also need to make sure that the study has integrity and is transparent with the participants, including debriefing the participants at the end of the study to explain to the participants information about the study. Today, the AAP has created ethical standards that must be followed by all researchers in order to protect their human and animal subjects. At the end of the day, researchers who create ethical studies will make sure that the study respects people's rights and dignity. And that's what you need to know for Unit 1, Topic 6. I can't believe it, but we're already done with all the topic review videos for Unit 1. Now, you know the drill. Make sure you answer the questions on the screen check your answers down below and if you want to see more psychology videos make sure to hit that subscribe button and drop a like on the video it's free you can always change your mind later but it's important because it lets me know that you like this content and you want more of it as always i'm mr sin and until next time i'll see you guys online